call me Commander Shepard. From now on, I'll call you Commander Shepard, okay? Yeah. Guys, the thing is, within the next few months, I want to do a video, a shout out video, where I don't only give shout outs to people who make videos but mainly to people who comment. Those of you subscribers who comment a lot of my videos. I also want to start reviewing things. But until we get to that point, I figured what I will do to kind of merge those two things together is I'm going to review your comments on my last video. Now, I haven't read any of these comments. Well, I've read like four, and I replied to them straight from my inbox. So uh, here we go. This is the driving while vlogging video. Uh, just to get this out of the way real quick, two things. One, I hate when people do video. They're like, I'm really sick, but I wanted to do a video. It's like, don't, don't do don't do one. Because I, I don't want to look at, you know, stunt running out of your nose. I don't, you know, don't do a video. But I am getting over something. Two, a guy here on YouTube named Havoc83 interviewed me and my wife on a new segment he's doing where he's interviewing YouTubers. The link will be below the video. You can go there and check it out. We talk about everything from gaming to professional wrestling and, and whatnot. So here we go. The first, speaking of Havoc83, it looks like he was the first guy to comment on my last video. He said, driving and vlogging equals big no-no, Mav. Yeah, well, you know what? I, I, you know, I, I, it's hard when you don't get time. You just got to make time. I'm going to start doing them in the shower, probably, just to you know, kill two birds, one stone. Benoit DDD42 says, yeah, man, more vids equal awesome. I'm probably going to watch the podcast tonight. Awesome, dude. I hope you enjoyed the podcast. We took two weeks off, but we'll be back next week. Papa Hotel, who's on the podcast, said, oh, you meant driving home while you you were going to post a video. Geesh, Mav, get a camera guy. I told Papa after we left the podcast, I was like, dude, I want to do a video. I'm assuming he thought when I got home. No, on the way home. The Beast Radamus said, Bioshock Infinite, The Witcher 2, and The Darkness 2. LOL. Uh, I asked what your fate, what games you're most anticipated about, uh, or your most anticipated games, rather, in 2012. The Beast Radamus, you can click on his name. He makes Call of Duty video, uh, 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 multiplayer commentaries. But his commentaries are really crazy because he talks about, like, ghosts and UFOs and conspiracy theories, so they're pretty interesting. I am Blazin69 said, What's with the hair? You look like you can be a Wendy's well, you look like you can be Wendy's brother. Good stuff, man. I needed a haircut. Honestly, I'll be honest with you. It's not that I take my videos really seriously because I'm reviewing comments. So obviously, I don't take them that serious. But I do like to be, you know, at least I don't want to look too shaggy. So that's why I didn't do one for a while because I needed a haircut. Worst haircut of my life, by the way, that I got. Yosemite Emery said he's looking forward to COD9, Last Guardian, GTA 5, The Last of Us, Tomb Raider, Far Cry 3. Uh, Last Guardian, bro, you put that down. That's never coming out. We all know that. The Pivot Raptor says, Can't wait for Mass Effect 3. There's a lot of you out there, including myself. I am Commander Shepard, apparently. Or at least in this video, I am. Majora Legend says, My most anticipated game is Resident Evil 6. Should be good. We'll see. The Last of Us for sure by Ever Tony J, FO8. Catastrophic. Spelled differently. He replied to the Beast Dradamus and said, What's up, Beast? LOL. Long time no see. What a small, wor what a small world it is. Assuming he's a subscriber of, of Beast Dradamus. Catastrophic then put his favorite games that he's looking forward to are Bioshock, Infinite, Darksiders 2, and The Last of Us. Which will all be good. I'm hoping Darksiders 2 is better than the first one, although I don't think it will be. The Farzrach said Grand Theft Auto 5. I'm not sold on GTA 5 yet, to be honest with you. I love GTA series. I'm not sold on this one yet. It looks like, it, we obviously we've only seen one trailer. It just looks like more of the same. I want something different. I want to play a dirty cop, where you can make decisions on be, be a good cop or dirty cop. That's what I want. Jotun101, who makes videos, check him out. He says, my iPad didn't know. Ha, a likely story, young Mav. He's referring to a what I, something I said in the video. My iPad doesn't know that I'm a YouTube partner. So it doesn't know that I can do more longer videos in just 10 minutes. So it cuts me off at 10. The Real PS3 King said, Best YouTuber ever. Bro, thank you. I don't agree with you, but thank you so much. Brodio said, The Last of Us and SSX. And from watching Bro's videos, he's already enjoying SSX. Glock Ninja says, Aliens? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Unless you're referring to the game, Aliens Colonial Marines, which is my... 
most anticipated game of 2012. Psycho Billy Sutter said, GTA 5, Far Cry 3, and Call of Duty. Sarcasm is hard to read in text, so I don't know if you're being real by calling it Duty or just... I don't know. Salty DK Zero says Minecraft for the Xbox and GTA 5. Man, you guys are really looking forward to GTA 5. Well, here's a name for you. Brutana Nana Nana Dulski says keep making vlogs. They're good. Thank you. Young Ratchet 86, GTA 5 all day, baby. That's what he said. Or she. I don't, you know, it's that's a he. That's a he. I know that. I don't know what's a he. Jay Varak says, I know what your most anticipated game is, Mav. Black Ops 2, back to crack. Yeah, I think a lot of people, maybe not you guys, but like my friends in real life are expecting, dude, when Black Ops 2 comes out, crack that code too. I don't really know if that's going to happen. It's probably, it's kind of funny because my, my wife, my wife to, couldn't care less about, about videos. Doesn't care. Just does not care. And after the Black Ops thing, the next big game that came out, whatever it was, she was like, uh, to get around on the internet more, why don't you do crack another one of those codes in, in that game? Because not all games have them. The John2280 said, Sorry, Mav, I thumbed down the video because I dislike vlogging while driving. It's bloody dangerous. It is. It is. I accept that dislike. I'll accept that one. You, you Cool Doe says, I'm happy you're doing vlogs again. He makes videos, quite good videos too. Very quick, won't blow up your sub box. You Cool Doe, check him out. Burning Fumes, I bet I made you wipe your screen. And he did that thing that's got the little mark that makes it look like I still don't know how people do that but it's cool the Gene Light Show says so glad the podcast is back I listen to you guys every week when I was working night shift for two months straight four days a week nine hours a day it was brutal especially being my first job and I was all by myself you guys kept me company along with Joe Rogan's podcast thanks guys well Gene Light thank you very much but tell Joe Rogan if you ever see him that I will whoop okay I would knock his head off Joe Rogan wait is he the okay? He's the black belt guy. Never mind. From he's UFC commentator, dude. Never, don't don't tell him I said that. Face Volume Five said, "I would like to see more Viz just like this." Mav, been wondering why you never did them. Didn't know you guys were into it. That you guys only subscribe because of the comedy. Apparently not. It's good to know. E W W W T says Darksiders too. P S N, Anti Dizzo said your vlogs are cool. I like them, but I hope you don't abandon your jokes. I'm not going to. I'm still going to do the stand-up thing. In fact, I'm working on some jokes right now. I would like to do like a 20-minute set and put it up for you guys. But, got to perfect it. 187 Erm Killa said, Loving the vlogs, mate. Don't give up the jokes, though. I won't. He also replied to the John by saying, Vlogging while driving is pretty cool, though. But it is dangerous. He's right. Electric Tear said, Don't worry, you can pimp anything. I believe I said in that video, I hate pimping the podcast on YouTube because some of you guys don't care. I don't want to jam it down your throats. Hero of something, cool name, said, you should have said, I'm Maverick 10 and I'm out of gas. <laughs> that would have been funny. E Revere 94 makes videos. I sub to him. You should too. Says, thanks for mentioning my comment on your face from Facebook on Player vs. Podcast. You're welcome, dude. That's what, that's, you know, that's what we do. The Beast and Alex makes videos. He did the Habanero Challenge as well. So these vlogs are great. Gary Emmett said, I'm Maverick 10 and I just got pulled over. <laughs> yeah, I should have said that too. Love the vlogs, bro. bro. Still wish you would bring PvP to YouTube. That's something we're thinking about. Cookie Monster Lives 54. I enjoy anything by you, really. Thanks, man. Really, he's like, really? Not everything. Most of the stuff you do is pretty entertaining. It's okay. And that's it. That's all of them. That video didn't get very many views. A lot of people wonder why I, you guys say, why do you only make videos like once a week? Well, when I do like two a week, the second one gets like four views. And yes, I, that's pretty much saying I do videos for the views. But if you do take time out of your day to do something like this and put yourself out there, you want more than four people to check them out. So that was it, guys. I just saw a video, and I don't know why I'm talking about this, but I just saw a video, and I felt bad for the girl. Uh, so I, I, I encourage you to do the same thing. This, this, there was a video that a kid online, it's on the front page of YouTube, where he was yelling, he was on his dad's shoulders yelling at a, at a sporting event, and he poked himself in the eye. And that was funny, it's like eight seconds long. In the related videos, this girl, probably 35 years old, made a video ab about that video. It's like 30 seconds long, where she said, so the kid, 
I was on the shoulder, <laughs> on the, the shoulder <laughs> of the dad, and he poked himself in his eye. It's really funny, <laughs> and it's <was> funny. <laughs> I'm thinking, why would you make a video about that? But then I read the comments, and everyone was like, you know, show your tits, you're a stupid whore, why are you doing videos like this, you're so stupid. It had a ton of dislikes, so I thumbed it up, and I was like, great vid, you know, good stuff, because I felt bad. You ever guys ever feel bad about someone like that, or anyone like that? There used to be a website my friends in college would go on called hotornot.com, and it, you would rate people. They would put their pics up. Anytime I saw, like, a, I'm not being, but anytime I saw someone who was a little overweight, a girl, you know, maybe had some bad acne, clearly was homely, I would always give her, like, a 10. And, like, the chicks that you know, like, you know that they know that they're hot, they're getting a 1. Every time they're getting a one, so you, I'd move their average down from like ten to like nine point nine. You know, I feel bad for people sometimes, and you know the, the ugly chicks get a ten. So that's it, guys. I'm Maverick Ten. Something else I hate. I hate when people don't know how to end the videos. They just keep talking. And you ever you watch a video and someone's like, "Well, that's about it," and they say that like five times, gets on my nerves. Anyway, the link in the description is to the interview with me and my wife done by Havoc. It's long, so if you watch it, bring a snack. I'm Maverick 10, and I'm out of breath.